Welcome to Code Report. I'm your host, Connor Hookstra. Last week we had five contests. Two of them were from Code Forces. On Saturday we had round 554, and on Sunday we had round 550. Also on Saturday we had from Top Coder the SRM 754 contest. From Code Chef we had the March lunchtime contest, and on Saturday evening we finished off with the weekly Leak Code contest number 130. And also throughout the week we had from Hacker Earth the nine day long March circuits contest. Taking a look at the top 10 leaderboards for the Top Coder, Code Chef, and Leak Code contests, here they are. We only had one individual to place on multiple top 10 leaderboards, and that individual was Yui, who placed first in the Division 1 Code Chef lunchtime contest and second in the Leak Code number 130 contest. We also had a bunch of other familiar names, though. In the Division 1 of the Top Coder contest, we had in first, Tourist, in third, Stonefang, in fifth, Snook, in sixth, our term in seventh raveman and in eighth pashka and also in the code chef contest for division one we had in third place f souza in fourth place zeman and in seventh place natsugiri taking a look at the top 10 leaderboards for the code forces and hacker earth contest we didn't have any individuals placing on multiple top 10 leaderboards but we did have a number of very familiar names in our division one of the round 549 from the code forces website in first we had umnik in third we had ben q in fourth we had dotoria in ninth we had mnbv mar and in tenth we had aricto Taking a look at the overall top 10 leaderboards for the Code Forces website, we had a little bit of movement, but it was all due to ultimately one rating change, and that was MNBV Mar going from third place to sixth place. So first and second with Tourist and Umnik didn't change, and Pyotr and WXHTXDY uh, jumped up from fourth and fifth to third and fourth, respectively, and the individuals from seventh to tenth all remain in their same spots. And one last final reminder, the Google Code Jam contest, or at least the qualifiers, will be starting this Friday. So you can still register, and I believe you'll still be able to register while the qualifiers are going on. Uh, but make sure to do that and make sure to compete. And another announcement, tune in this Thursday for a live stream of the final two hours of the ICPC uh, World Finals. The ICPC, if you're not familiar, it is a contest that is for university students that compete um, sort of at an international level. They start at regionals and then they make their way up to nationals for some bodies and then they go on to the ICPC uh, World Contest. This year it's being held in Porto, Portugal and I'll be doing a live stream, not on my channel, but on Gaurav Sen's channel. I'm sure many of you are familiar with his channel if you've been watching mine as I've plugged him several times. Uh, we'll be going live at Pacific Standard Time, 8 a.m. for two hours, and uh, for Gaurav, his local time is India Standard Time. He'll be going live at 8.30 p.m. So that's this Thursday. Uh, be sure to tune in. It's going to be a lot of fun. It'll sort of be an AMA, sort of uh, commenting on what's going on in the contest, and hopefully we'll be able to live stream uh, both sort of us talking and the contest at the same time. Taking a look at the contests that are happening this upcoming week, we have four of them as well as, as the two aforementioned events. So on Thursday, we've got the ICPC live stream happening at 8 a.m. On Friday, we have the start of the April Long Challenge from Code Chef, and we also have the start of the qualifiers for the 2019 Google Code Jam. And then on Saturday, we have three contests. From Code Forces, we have the Global Round number two. From Hacker Earth, we have the April Easy Contest. And from Leak Code, we have the weekly Leak Code contest number 131. And this video is brought to you by Top Coder. Make sure to check out their practice problems and contests at www.topcoder.com. As always, if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, hit that like button. If you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button. You can follow me on Twitter for reminders 30 minutes before contests start, and you can find all of the code shown in my videos on my GitHub page. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.